Welcome back to Copper Age Gold. We are checking out WWE Superstars action figure of Ric Flair. Make sure you go to Entertainment Earth for all of your action figure and collectible needs. Use code COPPER to save yourself 10% off all in-stock items and get free shipping on orders $79 or more from Wave 1 of the WWE Superstars line. I picked this up at Ollie's. Good stuff cheap, really cheap for only $3.99. I couldn't pass it up. I had to grab it. Let's check this thing out. So this Ric Flair figure comes with a microphone an entrance robe, and I believe some extra hands and a set of sunglasses, which you can put on your Ric Flair figure if you choose. Pretty cool packaging. I really like this. I think it looks really well. Uh, pretty good likeness of Ric Flair from the 80s, although he was never, never this muscular, but it's made to be cartoonish, which that's fine. That's cool. On the back, we get to see the Nature Boy. Styling and profiling. To be the man, you gotta beat the man. And I don't think so. Also in the line, Honky Tonk Man, Hollywood Hulk Hogan, and Bray Wyatt. Rest in peace. Here's a look at the Ric Flair figure with the microphone that he comes with in his right hand. The microphone is a little big to actually fit in his right hand properly. So keep that in mind when you're posing your Ric Flair figure. This Ric Flair figure also comes with fisted hands for each side. He also comes with open hands for each arm as well. He also comes with a pair of sunglasses, which you can see right here. And these look pretty nice as well. Here's the Ric Flair figure with the four fingers up for the four horsemen, baby. He is wearing his glasses, which I think look pretty cool. But like other people have said, I don't like the glasses without the suit. If he had a cloth suit to go over his gear, I think that'd be really cool. Maybe that's an upcoming release. I don't know. Probably not now that he's not under the WWE umbrella. But the glasses go on pretty good. I would recommend taking the head off to put the glasses on and then putting the head back onto the body. The entrance robe is pretty thin. So be careful when you're playing with the robe. I'm going to leave my figure with a knotted robe because there's no way I'm getting that knotted as good as that is. Pretty cool action figure, especially for four bucks at Ollie's. I highly recommend finding this at Ollie's if you're a Ric Flair fan. Pretty cool in my opinion. Woo! Here's the WWE Superstars Ric Flair action figure compared to his 1990 Galoob action figure which is his second action figure, with his first being the AWA action figure. So the only thing I wish they would have done differently with this Ric Flair action figure would have been to give him an alternate head with him doing his classic woo. That would have been cool. And add the WCW championship. Every Ric Flair figure should come with that title belt.